from Crema Media in Johannesburg, this is The Real Economy Report. Turkish appliance manufacturer Archelik has made its entry into the South African markets with its global brand Biko, which is the biggest home appliances brand in the UK. Malane Onaldi visited the store. Archelik decided to expand the brand into more sub-Saharan African markets since the African continent has a growing middle-class population and is poised for rapid urbanization once its population reaches an estimated 1.7 billion by 2030. Beko is already available in 20 African countries including Nigeria, Kenya, Angola, Rwanda, Mauritius, Ghana and Tanzania and more than 100 other countries worldwide. Beko Regional Marketing Director for Sub-Saharan Africa, Rajan Gunjia, tells us more about the stores it has established as a starting point and the company's plan to roll out more. So this is very exciting for us as we open up the first store, like you said, uh, yet the design quarter. Uh, we soon to open up uh, a second store in the Crescent in Amschlange and this is part of an expansion plan where we really want to give consumers the Beko experience and we feel that this layout and this uh, style of store is what consumers are going to connect with. So over the course of the next three years we wish to open up another eight stores in all the main provinces in urban areas across the country. In catering to the changing demands of consumers, Beko undertakes extensive research to understand their needs and global trends. This research and development becomes evident in Beko's detailed aesthetic touches with product design through to how appliances now cater to increased hygiene needs as a result of COVID-19. Additionally, with homes increasingly doubling as multifunctional hubs, time management has become a bigger priority. To this end, Beko appliances boast short and smart programs that allow consumers to be more time efficient, which also bodes well for reduced energy use. Gunjia shares some insight into how the company differentiates itself in the market. Yeah, it's differentiated in multiple ways. Obviously, we've done uh, uh, a huge amount of consumer insight to understand the needs and wants of consumers, also the, during the pandemic and over COVID. And we've addressed that by delivering design solutions and technology solutions that help consumers and transform their lives every day. So we've done extensive uh, perceived quality tests to understand uh, the, look, the touch and feel of our products. We've looked at the very specific features in our washing machines, our dishwashers, our cooling equipment and laundry and uh, ovens to make sure that the single-minded uh, benefit and feature is differentiated to opposition but it does make a tangible difference to the lives of these consumers. Research shows that up to 40% of all household consumption is associated with the use of home appliances. So Beko considers it an imperative to supply appliances that are eco-friendly and help reduce household carbon footprint. Beko has consistently won excellence awards for its products' as energy efficiency and also prioritizes water efficiency in designing its washing machines. For example, Beko washing machines use a filtration system that removes up to 90% of microplastics from wastewater, which limits these materials ending up in the ocean. The company also uses recycled materials in the manufacturing of its appliances. Gunjia elaborates on these efforts. Beyond the obvious of obviously energy and water efficiency, I think that uh, we focus a lot on sustainability and making sure that um, you know, we give back to the environment as much as we take out from it. So we're involved in quite a few programs where we're using recycled material in our new projects but also our existing appliances. So over the course of the last 18 months we've already started projects where we're using recycled PET bottles to make our new washing machine drums. We're using uh, fish nets um, uh, in special features within our cooling equipment. We're using biodegradable ingredients like uh, soybean, uh, sugar cane, uh, eggshells to produce certain components that go into our cooling equipment. And we believe that uh, that's our first step towards uh, more sustainable products that are better to the environment. That's Crema Media's Real Economy Report. Join us again next week for more news and insights into South Africa's real economy. And don't forget to listen to the audio version of our engineering news daily email newsletter.